12 people, including three children, woke up today without a home after a fire destroyed multiple mobile homes in North Charleston last night. That fire happened on Beret Street. That's right there near Cathedral of Praise. And neighbors have been spending the day surveying the damage and trying to figure out what they could save. Our Emily Zuhowski is out there now. And Emily, you've been talking with neighbors all day long. How are they getting along? Yeah, I have. It's now been exactly 24 hours since firefighters were called here to Beret Street. And although the heavy smoke and fire is gone, neighbors are now dealing with the aftermath. And as you can see behind me, the damage is pretty severe. The North Charleston Fire Department, along with multiple other agencies, responded just before five yesterday evening to the heavy smoke and flames coming from one home, which eventually spread to several others. Neighbors did come together to help, though. One and I spoke to said that he and another neighbor used their personal hoses to help put out a fire on the fence behind their homes to keep it from spreading as firefighters worked on the mobile homes. Another stuck figuring out what to do next is almost everything he owned is now gone except for his car, which he plans to now live in. I mean, it's completely gone. There's I mean, I hope to say I got the cast irons, you know, but there's really nothing there to you know, compared to what we had. North Charleston fire officials say one firefighter was evaluated for non life threatening injuries and this fire is still under investigation. Now the Red Cross is helping some of these families out and I'll tell you how coming up tonight at seven reporting live in North Charleston. Emily Zuhowski, Live 5 News.